global viewers from around the world. I'm Kristen Schwartz, licensed midwife and MC for Gold Learning. And I'm here today with Kate White, and we're going to chat about her upcoming presentation titled, It Was Right But So Wrong, Helping Families Make Sense of Difficult Births with Trauma-Sensitive and Prenatal and Perinatal Healing Approaches. Welcome, Kate. Hi, thank you. It's great to be with you again. Thank you so much for coming again, sitting down here with me and chatting a little bit about the presentation. We are very excited to have you, especially uh, talking about this topic on trauma. And um, But before we jump into that, tell our listeners a little bit about yourself and, and your background and your professional journey. Oh, great. Thanks for asking. Well, I'm a somatic practitioner, which means I work with the body and I've been doing this a long time now. I've been doing it about almost 20 years, maybe more than that. And I I was in maternal and child health before I became a body worker. So I've been really working as a maternal and child health professional for over 25 years. And I got into this work because my clients were, were remembering their births on my table. I was newly I received my diploma in craniosacral therapy, and uh, they spontaneously began to remember their births, and I didn't know that that could happen. I didn't know that people had the memory of birth in their body as an adult. And so I went and studied, and I learned quite a bit about uh, just birth memory and somatic memory and trauma and how it gets stuck in the body and Went and did more and more training. So I got somatic experiencing trained, which is a somatic resolution therapy. And I've specialized in working with mom and baby dyads and families that have had difficult births. And I spent uh, six years working with a midwife named Lois Trezice. She and I formed a, a unit, and we would prepare families for birth. And then we would uh, she would catch the baby, and I would catch the family. And if there was any trauma, I was able to help families prepare to put back behind them. Usually it's the first birth was overwhelming. I usually get a lot of moms that are going into their second birth and they're feeling scared. And I worked with a lot of moms after birth to help them to normalize the, if it was difficult and help them heal. And now here I am many years later, I, a lot of my practice is helping moms and babies. I have a lot of special training and helping babies feel better in their body. But really, I, I really just help a lot of moms, too. So I have a body work practice, and people come, and I, I'll, I'll explain a little bit about that in my talk, just how I work and how I would like to train and have others know what I do, especially those people on the front lines. Thank you so much for sharing that, Kate. I, I loved how you worded it uh, when you worked with a midwife. She caught the baby and I caught the family. What a wonderful way of um, describing it and presenting that. Um, so, so now going into your topic, and uh, the title is, It Was Right But So Wrong. Um, before we go a little bit deeper, uh, what, tell us a little bit about the title itself. Yes, the, the title is a mouthful, but it was right but so wrong was something that one of my first clients here in Charlottesville, Virginia, where I live, um, what she said when I went to help her with her difficult birth. And it helped. I'm going to tell the story in my presentation. Um, and she, she said that her birth was right but so wrong. And I will, I will use the, the story there to jump off into explaining some of the things to notice as a birth professional, some things that you may or may not hear um, as someone who helps families, and or if you are a woman who is has given birth and has had a difficult story, it may resonate, but I'm going to talk about working with her and how I helped her heal and her husband and her baby. Um, so the birth was, uh, I really just have to come to the presentation. Uh, I'll, I'll, let, I'll leave it as a cliffhanger so people will come and listen. <laughs> well said. Thank you. That was very good. And we do want our listeners to come and, and come to the presentation. That is absolutely right. So, But before I let you go, just a little bit of what do you hope our listeners will take away from this presentation? Well, I want listeners who are working on the front lines with birth and families uh, to know that they are very important. 
even though a lot of times we'll talk about the importance of the mom and have helping her, which I will talk about that, and the importance of helping babies, um, I, I also want to talk about helping birth professionals. They are part of the surround, which is the environment around a, a birthing family and around a postpartum mom. And so how, how a professional is in her body or his body also plays a role in, in how birth unfolds and what happens afterwards and then even in the preparation phase. Uh, so I, I would love for those listeners to know how important they are. And I also want people to understand more about the importance of somatic trauma healing. Uh, it is all about survival energy and also the trauma of our everyday life. We've learned so much now about uh, what happens for people and their bodies. And we know that it's so key for women to feel safe while they're pregnant and that their experiences transfer to the baby's experience and can even play a role in increasing the difficulty of a birth. So I want people listening to feel empowered, to have tools to take away, things to think about, and um, and feel like they are definitely important, important piece of the whole puzzle when it comes to creating birth, good birth outcomes. Well, thank you, Kate. That sounds absolutely fantastic. I can't wait to hear your presentation. And thank you so much for sitting down here with me chatting about it. Yes, thank you for taking the time. And I, I, I like talking with you. So I um, look forward to giving the presentation. Thank you so much, Kate. The presentation, it was right but so wrong. Helping families make sense of difficult births with trauma-sensitive and prenatal and perinatal healing approaches by Kate White is part of the Mental Health in the Perinatal Period Lecture Pack. For more information on this presentation and on the other presentations in this lecture pack, please visit goldlearning.com. Thank you, everyone, for listening. Bye-bye.